Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. My name is Mevelyn and welcome back to Jurassic Park Operation Genesis. It's been a long time since we've uh, visited our little park here. And I can't remember what dinosaurs we got. We've got ourselves a Parasaurolophus. Is there anything else in this tank? Tank? Enclosure? Yeah, Taurosaurus. And was it a Carchon? Well, yeah, I can't kind of fucking pronounce it, bastard. What have we got in here? Acrocanthosaurus. Okay. Is that all we've got? Dinosaur summary? Yes, okay. So, there's nothing in the genetics. So, they're the only dinosaurs we can actually have at the moment. Um, obviously, we've got our fossil teams working away as fast as they can, trying to get me some stuff. We need an extra star. Um, oh, we've just lost one. How the fuck have we lost a star? This game just go fuck itself. Right, okay, we need to add some add some in rides or something in this uh, in this bitch. Is this a viewing platform? Um, let's stick one here. Can you can see right over the park? Uh, don't know what we're going to call it yet, but at the price 30, 30 bucks. Fuck it, yeah, to see the park duration as long as possible. Make the guests nice and happy. Playtime platform. Cause it looks like we're able to see into this enclosure this enclosure just here how fuck your how are we doing on the research no I don't know that's a emergency mode how are we doing on the research front okay dinosaur flu's almost done um, we'll then get the our lovely little dinosaurs vaccinated do you, do you do you need to be vaccinated do you do you you get the flu no Okay, a little uh, mad moment there for me. Where's that uh, that quick fucking hell? Can't pronounce the bastards. Oh, he's he's, he's made a kill. He's made a kill. Message from Dr. Grant. Message from Dr. Grant. Well, it's not about. Uh, I'm gonna sell the amber for the cash. Um, but I'll you. I will extract that because that should make it 100 percent then. Uh, some more visitors on the way. I need to find out why we lost that. Star. Okay, so finally we've got our uh, one star. Uh, it's taken it's taken me about 25 minutes to get that back. There's been sort of waiting around. Uh, what I have managed to do now is all of the um, immunizations have been researched. Uh, I'm now currently researching the um, hatchery immunization which means that any dinosaurs that I grow uh, going for once it's been researched will then automatically have all of the immunizations which means I have then haven't got to fork out thousands and thousands of dollars not that I haven't got that much money anymore um, means I've got to spend thousands and thousands of dollars immunizing my dinosaurs luckily because I've been playing for a while Let's get some more cleaners in. Um, all the opals and excess dinosaur DNA that I've been finding, I've been selling. So I've got a bit of money now. Uh, so all my dinosaurs are at 100%. We can now have a look at a new dig site. So we'll zoom in, get you lot out of there. What do we want? I mean, info. Site A here, we can get ank. Kylosaurus, Albertosaurus, Pachycephalosaurus. Well, for Site B, we can get Tyrannosaurus, Corythosaurus, or a Styracosaurus. Uh, B here, we can get a Trike, or an Edmontosaurus, or a Pachycephalosaurus again. This one, any decent ones? We can get a Stegosaurus and a Brachiosaurus on the two different ones there. Or we can go for a Spinosaurus. It's one of my favourite ones, that one. Brachiosaur there. Or... Oh, we've got Raptors. I'm going to go for... Oh, the Brachiosaur. We'll go for this one first. So we'll get... We'll zoom in there. Get my beautiful... Actually, we could buy another couple of teams now, couldn't we? That's it, we can have five. There and there. There we go. 
we'll do that. Um, so, what was the other time? <laughs> we got any carnivores here? Zoom in. Oh, wrong one. Uh, info, there we go. Uh, we've got an Allosaurus, so we're going to have to build a Allosaurus enclosure. Otherwise, if I stick him in this one, our beautiful Acrocanthosaurus, our beautiful Acrocanthosaurus will eat it. So what we're going to do is we'll build a path out this way. If it lets me, there we go. We don't, he doesn't need a very big enclosure because he's not very big. So we'll build one here. Like that. That should do him. Should do him nicely. We'll give him a carnivore feeder down here. He's only a small one, so we'll give him... I think he's only a small one, so we'll give him goats. Uh, how much longer have we got left for that? So that's almost done, which is good. It's almost done. It's just finished. Epic. So we'll now build... We need to get... See, I remembered... I've realised why we lost the star. Um, while I was waiting for us to get the one star back uh, I had the quarterly review and obviously a load of people died in our last episode so I completely forgot about it it's been so long since I played it in the, uh, the, t the twister that happened at the end of our last episode so we need a place for our visitors to hide so we're going to build the visitor shelter next you don't seem very happy what's the matter with you? not bad I guess God, no. oh, here's another quarterly report as well now Inter right. So this time they're satisfied, so that's good. We've got our star back, they're happy. Our dig teams are being used, our research teams are being used. They're all happy. They're happy. They like it. We're going to build a viewing platform in here, ready to go. Which will be the through a window, but we're going to close that for the moment. We've got ourselves some Brachiosaurus and Kentrosaurus remains. Okay, we've just done research the Visitor's Shelter. So that will go into place either side of the entrance. That way, instead of customers, if we set the emergency alarm off, instead of customers leaving the park, um, they'll still be in the park. Which means when the alarm, when we reset everything, make sure the park's safe, take the alarms off, um, the majority of the customers will then go back into the park rather than um, that, rather than the fact they've just left. So we'll still be getting their money, money, money. Banam, 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 bam, 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 money, 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 money. We're gonna stick another viewing vent there because of that Tyrannus, uh, the Acrocanthosaurus that's there. We're getting a lot of uh, DNA now as well, so we'll soon be able to start. Uh, soon be able to start getting some more dinos, which will be nice. Oh no, one of my Taurosaurus died. Oh, one year. Fuck. Does that mean they're all about to pop off? Need to find another Taurosaurus. One year, one year, yeah, fuck. One, oh, they're at the end of their life. Um, obviously, now that we've, yeah, that, yeah, there another one goes. Genetics lab is full. Fuck. Okay. I'm finding more, fu finding and buying more fossils than uh, I'm able to process. Spin along the Acrocan the uh, Allosaurus, just so we've got a new dinosaur in the park. That'd be nice. I now need to. Where's my Taurosaurus? Get a load of these going now. I'm going to put 10 in this time to make a proper nice little herd rather than just having the usual, um, like the 5 that we did stick in. And when the Parasaurolophus go, uh, I mean, how long have they got left? Yeah, so they'll be dying off soon. I'll just do 10 of those as well. So we can get some nice, some nice, oh, there's no Taurosaurus gone. So we can get some nice herds going off, which I think would be quite nice. Better experience for our visitors. I mean, later on, I'll probably I'm, I'm thinking about mixing the carnivores and herbivores together somewhere, which I reckon will be another quite cool experience. Add a bit of realism to the park. 
almost got enough for our Allosaurus. Which means I can take, I can move, remove all these now. Because that will make it 100%. And then I can just go Boosk, 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 Boosk. There we go. Yeah, it's full. I know I'm working on that one. <coughs> so we should have our Allosaurus in a moment. So we can open up the new pad. Ready. There we go. I'm researching a high security fence now because of the fact we've also got quite a large dinosaur in here that these are only low security fencing. There we go, medium security fence. So we'll get some new updates going, which will be right, let's get a new attraction in. We'll go for we'll go for the balloon tour, that's always fun. Taurosaurus has collapsed. There's probably not much point in reviving it to be honest, because it's gonna die. It's on its one year period. Okay, so we've got the Allosaurus remains now, which is great. Not all remains, we've got Allosaurus DNA to 100%, which means we're going to go plonk one in. How cool is that? Oh, he's going to go eat, he's going to go eat. Damn, you hungry. Cool. So we got an Allosaurus in the park, finally. What else are we working on now? So, oh yeah, we need to upgrade our fence. Upgrade, it's going to cost 18 grand. Boosh, done. So that's made the park a little bit more secure. Um, along with those, so we should have quite a good secu security rating now. Where is it? There it is. Good, awesome. Could be a little bit better, but I'm happy with that for now. Got some more opals for the park. Yes. So that's Brachiosaur, Brachiosaur, Kentrosaurus. So obviously Brachiosaurus is the one that we're lacking in at the moment. So Kentrosaurus will probably be the next dinosaur that we're going to get in our park. That will remain to be seen. Um, so we've done well. We've done rather well so far. Not bad at all. Uh, oh, let's see, here we go. The Parasaur loafers have now started dying off. I'm going to get another five of those. What I'm also going to do is I'm actually going to build another hatchery here. Cause if John Hammond. Oh, we got another star. Fuck me. I'm going to build another hatchery here. Because, oh, I fucked that up, didn't I? Because if I'm going to start buying herds... There we go. It means that I can have multiple, like, set. Right, Parasaur, right, let's go back to the beginning. We've got a new star. Awesome. Brachiosaur, Parasaur has died. Okay. So it means I can have ten dinosaurs being built at once instead of one. Uh, instead of five, sorry, which is nice. Up that to 1,500 to match our extra half a star. Put it up to 2,000 when we hit the two star rating. We're doing well. I'm quite glad we've got half a star. We haven't even released the other two dinosaurs yet. Um, that's nice. Unfortunately, they are starting to die now. Because these ones we built, we uh, grew them, bred them, before uh, we had 100% DNA, which means their lifespan isn't quite so long. So I'd like that be another Parasaur loafers. So with the other... Um, because we've got 100% DNA here, then they'll last for five years rather than just the one. Which is nice. Found an amber. I'm going to sell that because it's probably not going to be much use to me anymore. Let's get this DNA going off. We'll use the good stuff before we use the crap stuff. Right. Found nothing. Found nothing. That means the uh, fossil li fossil digging site that we have at the moment is starting to run a little bit dry. Obesity well. I'm going to stick a path down the middle here and s fill it with benches and stuff for the moment just so we've got just we've got a bit of decoration and stuff about the place there we go another dinosaur died oh dear um, I'm trying to think what we can add over here to be honest because it's looking a bit bare 
maybe I might build another entrance. So instead of all the passengers, all the visitors um, getting off here, perhaps we can have them getting off somewhere else. I'm not sure where though. Like maybe if we built one over here, maybe one over this side, and maybe one at the north, perhaps. I don't know. Leave a comment in the comments down below. And let me know what you think. Okay, so we got ourselves a nice, a nice little herd of Kentrosaurus. More on the way. Our Brachiosaurus is almost done. Um, it's got a little bit of a longer wait on that one. Um, we've got ourselves two balloon rides now, both of which are up in the air. We've got this one here, which covers. You can see the little waypoints, so it will sort of fly to this one, stop for a little bit for for the guests to take their photos, move on to the next one, stop, move on to the next one, stop, so forth, so forth. So that's gonna. Oh, Brachiosaurus remains. Are they better than what we've got? Yes. Right, so we should hopefully have a Brachiosaurus. I'm gonna sell that. So we should have a Brachiosaurus soon, or in the next episode. Well, I'm about to end this one here. We got our balloon ride here. It covers the herbivores. So in the next episode, we should get our Brachiosaurus and hopefully get our second star. Um, I'm probably gonna start playing after the next episode. I'll probably start playing the actual sort of campaign, if you can call it that, for this game. Because uh, I haven't played that in Yonks, and it'll, it'll be interesting to see what it's like again now from my eye, from my perspective now, I'm a bit older uh, from when I last played this game properly. Um, so thank you so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, please leave a like and uh, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Do not forget to subscribe for more great content from Mevelyn. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.